He just goes and attacks that ball. And that's the word Roy Williams used when he was discussing the freshman. The fans of North Carolina had to wait 258 days. Three times. And curiously enough, every time Carolina especially picking up second chance points. So one of the areas for them is just getting shots and then allowing their big guys. How about that? Have you Very been to Olmstead? Have you been to Olmstead Point on the Tioga Pass Road in Yosemite? Spiders. The Richmond Spiders. San Diego and then Kansas, Kentucky at Bankers Life Fieldhouse in Indianapolis as we have a great one here tied at 60 North Carolina ball in transition. And he scores before he ever touches it because of the great position understanding how to pin. When you say really good pin, what do you mean? Uh, he, he got the guy on his backside, he pinned him then. Easy enough. Yeah. Pan oh, the poster. Pancaked away. Kessler stood straight up. Kessler. Turnover. Here comes Melvin. Melvin has it blocked. It goes off of him. What a defensive play by Caleb Love by Jameer Moultrie. Attacking the hoop. Caleb Love the other way. If you have to make play tech dribble that ball out there. Again, good hands as Love has it to play tech, and this is even easier. The numbers now. Love with eyes up, attacking on Askew, well, right to the rim. It's coming back for Kentucky. Look at that time with the nice little triple drive here. All the way to the rim. With seven to shoot, now five to shoot. Love looking for help. Love drives on Boston through the zone. And one. The coach of Brother Rice there in Chicago, <laughs> man. Both of them got the city on lock. <laughs> Out of the timeout, the drive in the hoop. Five to shoot, Beverly on the drive. Tried to scoop it, fed it to Bates, blocked out of there. Tar Heels on the run. Here's the lead and the dunk. Love. High arcing three-pointer. Urban Walton has just checked back into the game now for North Carolina. Give that shooter. They want that shooter on the floor. Leaky Black, out front, here's Love launching and hitting. We've got a big game later today on ESPN against Virginia. Louisville's at Miami on the ACC Network. And then Jay uh, on Monday night. Carolina in the midst of a 15-5 run. Playtech misses the three, kept alive by Baycott. Out to Love. Count it, and Carolina's got the lead. The offensive end, and he's been much more aggressive. You can see he's in a good place because of how he's played the last three games and just explode up. But he's really expanded his game this year. That foul, Jay, the fourth on Leaky Black. How about that play by Caleb Love? That long pass, terrific job by Caleb Love. That, that's really great feel to be able to knock that the other way. He watched it the whole way and knocked it away from Walker. Garrison Brooks steals that one away. Caleb Love, pull up, pop, and he hits it. That's pretty good defense. Caleb Love triggers a three, and he hits it. Ian Williamson have combined for 40 of Wake Forest's 59. Love muscling his way to the rim, follows his own shot, count it, plus the foul. Points are less, right now leading by 10. And Carolina fans have no nails left to bite, so they need a comfortable one down the stretch. That'll help. Watch out. And this is just unselfish right here. Poor post-entry pass. Once it got over half court, ball never touched the floor. But if you're a young player, that's how you run it. Again, breaking the press and hammering it home. Guess who? Caleb Love up to 20 on the night. North Carolina off of that offensive glass. Kevin Keith said himself, their best offense is once they miss a shot. And Wolfpack picking it up from the floor. Now six of its last eight. Two-point ball game, just over eight minutes remaining in the half. Caleb Love finds some space and buries the pull-up. 
definitely dominant in that area as well as scoring points in the paint. Caleb Love end to end for two more. Great action on the offensive end, the simple bash screen. Oda Cali, who's getting a lot of minutes here in the second half. Long look for Love, and he buries the shot. That's good offense. That was really good offense. They had three good opportunities, and the last one happened to be the best, just didn't get it to fall. Of course, with this one being here, the last one, assuming it takes place, will be in Chapel Hill, and yet another Duke turnover, and Caleb Love slams it down and draws a foul. Screen off that horn set. They just came out, blitzed it, almost trapped it, and Caleb Love who has had his issues as a freshman this season. Duke trying to steal some minutes without Matthew Hurd, who's got two fouls, without Mark Williams, the freshman, who's pulled down a bunch of rebounds. And that's really going to be a key for North Carolina, is getting the guards to rebound. And Love can try to take it coast to coast, and he will to tie the game. You can't get higher than your man in the corner on ball side. Otherwise, you're just going to inviting them to go back door. Kicked it opposite. And it was the next pass that got Joey Baker that wide open shot. Love having himself a game, isn't he? Love. Wow, a tough one. He wanted the foul call. Didn't get that, but he gets the bucket. Extra pass to Love. Yes, what a night for Caleb Love. The last three would have been over 50%. From the field, that's been typical Carolina basketball over the years. A ball deflects into the backcourt, and that's high percentage. As Caleb Love. <laughs> Caleb Love is the fadeaway. Guarding that three ball is, especially when you play UNC, you're going to draw the bigs out and kind of get that, you know, bigs have to guard the perimeter, and that's where the mismatch is because they get an easy basket. The Tar Heels easily, so I'm sure this is a game that Garrison Brooks has had scheduled on his calendar to make sure. Now the largest lead of the night for North Carolina, and as Fonz talked about, seems like in the last four or five minutes, maybe fatigue and the legs are starting to catch up with the Cardinals for all but 29 seconds of this first half. Can Carolina cash in on the turnover? Indeed they can. Over 17 per game and another chance off another UNC turnover. He does get back on this one and deny the two points from Carly Jones. Nice block, but... Well, think of it this way, Corey. The committee members, you know, they have a binder of player availability. Uh, football school. I know there are people that won't like that, but hey, that's the reality of it. But I don't think just because you're a basketball school now, in that loss to Georgia Tech, he's 0 for 6 on the floor tonight. He's missed four threes. And, and Sean, you know this program as well as any. As Caleb Love knocked down the first three for North Carolina. That's the problem. Giving up offensive rebounds off of free throw misses. Can Caleb Love, a big three for North Carolina. They're right back in it. Braswell, that's the guy they should foul if they can. He throws it away. 23 seconds to go. Love all the way to the bucket. He scores. Really what has let it down this year. North Carolina's defense has been pretty good. It's been top 25 in most of the metrics. Wide open. Caleb Love. A good try. So if you count that as a dunk, which I imagine they do, now 24 of Williams' 50 field goals are dunks between how they've shot the ball against Duke and then the games in between. Elbow jumper for Love, who's having a nice first half. Been in, in past years. The, the league is not rated the same way that it usually is. Love using the screen, driving past Hurt, and gets a tough one to go, and he's fouled as well. And that, that just shows you how different this year has been uh, for, for athletes, that, that they're living in hotels. And that, that's, that's a difficult thing. And they're, they're one of the, the lowest volume free throw shooting teams in the country. We'll step into the starting lineup in Garrison Brooks's spot. We will obviously now probably see more of Walker Kessler over the night as Caleb Love knocks down a three. Beautiful. Fake oh, a shot, man. draw a couple. Two beautiful passes in a row at both ends. Notre Dame as Love gets to the bucket. That they would have a size and depth advantage even without Garrison Brooks. Really pleased with the way they've been able to take advantage of that in the first half. They have to continue to do it. 
Gone a little bit cold at the offensive end recently in Carolina. Now with a chance to tie or take the lead. Love. And he's got it. Carolina's up by one. That big guy, Armando Baycott, stopped short. He should have kept going. Could have picked up a foul there. Love feeling it. Knocks down another one. 6 to shoot. Love will launch and hit a deep three. And Walker corrals it. And then Black picks it off. Bad decision there by Walker. Love for three. Got it. Love the handoff. And he got a switch. Got a big guy on him. Koprovica can move his feet. How wow. about that? What a shot for Love. Sharp, a very talented one. Do you have some insight into that, Grant? Personal uh, insight? <laughs> I've seen him a few times. Love chans a three. Caleb Love from deep. And the Chicago Bulls current starting lineup. Wow. That's all you need to know about their experience. <laughs> Love zigzag move. Contact. He finishes. Caleb Love showing off his abilities.